My name is Matt Beatty. I'm a physician assistant working here. Um, uh, basically been here for four years. Came straight out of a PA school from USC. Uh, this has been my first uh, employment area and loved it since. I definitely got to say I, I think I got lucky as far as um, falling into Health East, falling into Woodwinds because as I look back on it now, I probably couldn't have picked a better spot for the type of oversight that I probably would have wanted and needed coming right out of school and especially the docs that I work with. I mean, we have an excellent team here. Um, you know, one of the fears as being a, a mid-level is that you're going to put, put in your place or you're going to be that rank and, and there's, there isn't that. Um, we look at each other as, as colleagues or almost equals um, and that, that really makes it easy to do your job, easy to want to learn more, easy to, um, I guess, give the best patient care. That's, I guess that's, so I guess to answer your question quickly, uh, what brought me to Health East? I, I just luck. Kind of luck, but I'm, I'm certainly glad it worked out that way because I, I um, throughout the four years here, I've had other people kind of pull on my ear and say, hey, you interested in coming back to Regions or do you want to check out Children's or do that type of stuff? And I'm, I'm so happy here, I wouldn't, I, you know, I basically tell them no. I, it would take a Fort Knox to, you know, pull me away. So they seem to hold teamwork and, em and employee happiness at a pretty high standard here. They always want to hear what we uh, want maybe changed or what, what could make my job easier or better, what could make me happier. And I got to be honest, I think uh, you know a lot of times when we have those discussions, things do change because of those discussions. Um, you don't feel like you're just doing a review or an evaluation just to have it done, uh, that someone's going to listen to you and take your thoughts seriously. You know, if I was going to recruit a, a mid-level here, um, I, w I, w I, would, I would definitely tell them um, you have tremendous amount of backup and, uh, and support from your doctors. Um, and I think being a mid-level, the, the doctors that you work with can either make or break your career, or at least your happiness in that career. Um, and certainly everyone here, uh, we have there's obviously high expectations when you work in the emergency department, so not everyone fits that mold. But if you're kind of gung-ho and willing to learn and willing to listen, we got the perfect perfect setup for you to be successful in it. Um, I would definitely say that um, I, I've never felt thrown into the fire. I've never felt that I've been in a situation where um, if there's something that's above my, my practice level that I've felt that they've made me do. I've never felt worried in those situations. Um, if there's a sick person, the docs are right there so that I can, you know, I can walk out and there's tons of support, tons of help. Again, I, I just a, a great teamwork model, I guess. Um, and I would say, you know, obviously, you know, when we're choosing jobs, it's it's location, it's money. I mean, there's obviously other things in there, and I would say I've been very, very pleased with the compensation that I've uh, received. Um, you know, again, they, they keep us certainly at the you know upper percentile of the local market here uh, consistently. I've found myself getting um, uh, certainly pay increases, stuff that I have not had to ask for. It's it's basically by the uppers they review it, and and if we're lower on the market level, they change that to to be competitive. And and again, you know, that's obviously an intimidating thing when you're working to ask for raises or you know ask for more time off or any whatever that is. And here it's. It's like talking to your family or whatever. It's, it's very easy conversations to have with regards to that. In the, in the last four years, I can certainly say that there's been other opportunities that have kind of come knocking on my door and they just don't, they don't weigh up against what I have available to me here.